Welcome, dear children and all lovers of good fairy tales to my channel. This is channel dedicated to you. One times a week I will publish Goodnight Story. My name is Aliana and I will read for you. Tonight I'm gonna tell you a story about Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Once upon a time there were three bears who lived in a house in the forest. There was a great big father bear, a middle-sized mother bear and a tiny baby bear. One morning their breakfast porridge was too hot to eat, so they decided to go for a walk in the forest. While they were out. A little girl called Goldie Clock came through the trees and found their house. She knocked on the door and as there was no answer she pushed it open and went inside. In front of her was a table with three chairs. One large chair one middle-sized chair and one small chair. On the table were three bowls of porridge, one large bowl, one middle bowl and small bowl and three spoons. Goldilocks was hungry and the porridge looked good, so she ate in the great big chair pick up the large spoon and tried some of the porridge from the big bowl. But the chair was very big and very hard. The spoon was heavy and the porridge too hot. Goldilocks jumped off quickly and went over to the middle-sized chair. But his chair was fair, too soft. And when she tried to porridge from the middle side bowl, it was too cold. So she went over to the little chair and picked up the small spoon and tried some of the porridge from the tiny bowl. This time it was neaten, too hot or not too cold. It was just right and so delicious that she ate at all, but she was too heavy for the little chair and it broke in a piece under her weight. Next, Goldilocks went upstairs, where she found three beds. There was a great big bed, a middle-sized bed and a tiny little bed. By now, she was feeling retreat tried. So she climbed into the big bed and lay down. The big bed was very hard and fair, too big. Then she tried the middle side bed, but that was far too soft. So she climbed into the teeny little bed. It was neater, too hard, not too soft. In fact, it was just right all cozy and warm, and in no tiny at the gold lock fell fast asleep. In a little while the three bears come back from their walk in the forest. They saw at once that Pushet opened the door of their house, and the father bear locked it around then roared with a growly voice. Somebody has been sitting in my chair, Mother Bear said in a quiet, gentle voice. Somebody has been sitting in my chair, the little bear say in small baby voice. Somebody has been sitting in my chair and 
has broken it. Then Father Bear looked at his bowl of porridge and saw the spoon in the in it and he said in a great big lovely voice somebody has been eating my porridge then mother boar saw that her bowl had a spoon in it and said in her quiet voice somebody has been eating my porridge little bear looked at his porridge bowl and said in his small baby voice Somebody has been eating my porridge and has eaten it all up. Then the three bears went upstairs and Father Bear saw at once that his bed was until and he said in his great big growy voice, Somebody has been sleeping in my bed. Mother Bear saw that her bed too. Somebody has been sleeping in my bed. Then little bear looked at his bed and say in his small baby voice, Somebody sleeping in my bed. He squeaked so loudly that Goldilocks woke up with a start. She jumped out of bed and away she ran down the stairs and out into the forest, and the three bears never saw he, her again. Thank you for listening story for good night. If you like this video, make sure you like it and subscribe on my channel. Be sure to press the bell to get alerts when my videos are coming out. If you have any special desire to read your favorite story, write to me under the video and comments, my mail address, Facebook or Instagram profile. See the description of the video address. To the next video, sleep well and listen spoken soft. My stories. Good night.